Uh, Sean McDaniel here for Squamish Prefab. Just did another foundation, just finished pouring. Um, this is probably the sixth one we've done in the last two months. We've totally changed our plan from conventional. I'm at Red Sky Townhomes right now. We, we have five five plexes to do. Um, this is the first one. I've started a second one over yonder. From excavation, this building, I'm at about, with the pour today, I would say close to 20 man days. To do this conventionally, you would be looking at probably 35 man days to 40, and then you'd have to strip it, which would take another two solid days with a three-man crew. My bidding process, I'm able to, to bid this cheaper than conventional because it is so much faster and I need so few guys to do it. When you're doing the system, you have to just pay attention and make sure that all of the webs line up, but that's a function of just creating a marriage joint and working back and forth. You know, you can see at one point in the corner that the wall was actually 13 foot six high. Pour it all within four hours, didn't move. That uh, typically doesn't happen with conventional formwork. You always get a yeah. bit of a bend in the in the corner because of the pressures of, of concrete. To get a, a wall truly straight conventionally is is tougher to do, and, and you can't move the wall after you uh, you pour. With this system, the zuckles you can actually straighten a wall when it's 12 feet high and the concrete's still wet you can move it up to half an inch without any trouble. It, we used a helix mix in the concrete here. Um, it's a microfiber, it's twisted five times. It's basically the size of a brad nail. So typically to tie the rebar in something this big, this 160 feet of seven, 12 foot high wall would take two days for two guys. So that is taken right out of the uh, the picture all together with the helix mix it's just a super super system super uh, time saver and uh, you know from a business standpoint that's what it's all about so I just look forward to keeping going on uh, on doing this and not going home tired at night